This is the face of pure happiness. It also happens to be my face right after Minecraft Steve was revealed, which is something that I'm pretty sure nobody saw coming. Uh, except for me, of course. Realistic guess, quick. Minecraft Steve. Oh, it's Minecraft! It's is it actually? Minecraft! No way! Oh my god, he's an enderman. Steve. Holy... This is actually one of the things I'm so fucking excited about. I'm never excited for Smash characters. If it is Minecraft Steve, I will it's lose my fucking mind. Oh god. It's gonna be. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> no. I can't believe no. it. <laughs> Steve rocks a block. I, I but why am I so excited about Minecraft Steve being in Smash? Well, you see, I'm a simple man. I'm not a boomer. I don't really play RPG games. And like every other person on the planet, I don't give a fuck about arms. And so none of the DLC fighters so far have really grabbed my attention. Sure, I'll play them for a few weeks and make a few clickbait titles. In fact, I agree most of them have really fun and unique movesets. But in terms of the actual characters, I haven't played a single one of their games. In fact, apart from Banjo and Kazooie, I had no idea who any of these people were until they were revealed for Smash. And to be fair, that's because I'm an uncultured idiot. I have really stupid opinions on who should be in Smash. Avatar Aang is my most wanted character. <laughs> Like that's ever gonna happen. Waluigi is in second, followed by basically every other meme character on the planet. Because I don't actually play many video games, but I do like memes. I could spend all day theory crafting about which weapons Master Chief would use or how much range Puss in Boots' sword would have. But Steve, Steve was different. He was the one meme character who actually had a chance of making it into the game. I mean, even Nintendo wanted to put Minecraft in the game. The only obstacle, was Sakurai himself. <laughs> so you're still not gonna nerf Pikachu? Oh, that is evil. So, Sakurai, what do you think about putting Minecraft Steve as the next Smash Bros. DLC fighter? Well, I know that Minecraft is a very popular game, but aren't there better choices to put in a fighting game? Like, literally any other character? Hmm. You make a really good point. But you see, my nephew, he really loves Minecraft, so you reckon you can make it happen? Okay, I can do it. After all, his animations are quite simple, so it shouldn't be too hard. Oh, that's just fantastic. Now, we want to make sure he's a unique fighter, so I reckon we put in about 40 different weapons from Minecraft. We'll give him a really crazy new grab and throw animation, and over the top victory screen, oh, we gotta put in a new stage with tons of different random layouts. Oh, and we can put in biomes on the stage. Oh, and we'll make it so he can build blocks. Uh, so you might just need to change the mechanics on every single existing stage if that's all right. We seriously need to give it up for Sakurai, he outdid himself on this one. No matter what you think of the characters, every DLC fighter so far has had such a unique moveset and adds something new and interesting to the game, and that's all I ever wanted. I really don't care at all about green-haired Marth clone number 9 as a character, but you're telling me I can have a Falcon Punch with 3 times the range and super armor? Sign me up, and I hope that even if you're not as excited as me about Steve being in Smash, you can still enjoy building a whole damn house to trap the opponent in, or gimping them at 0% with a freaking minecart, and then spamming the eat cooked pork chop taunt. His final smash is also really hilarious, but I'm gonna wait to give my thoughts on Steve's moveset until after Sakurai showcases it tomorrow. So I think I'll finish by saying I don't really understand the Steve hate. Minecraft is such an iconic and popular game, it really does deserve to be represented in Smash, even if he is a goofy, blocky amalgamation of a character. That probably shouldn't be in a fighting game. But hey, did anyone stop to think if Pac-Man should be in a fighting game? No. But it's freaking Pac-Man, so who cares? Also, when the last two fighters were... Uh, less than exciting, I think Steve comes at a perfect time to shake up the expectations for Fighter Pass 2 and make people interested in Smash again. And after all that, if you still don't think Steve deserves to be in Smash, I guess I just have one thing to say to you. 